You know, whoever says don't judge a book by a cover is probably the dumbest person in the entire planet because what a person is on the outside is a reflection of what's going on up here. Here we go. Who I would want to have sex with. And how long have you been with your current boy boyfriend? Uh, six months. How long were you single before that? Oh, I had a, uh, another boyfriend from the movie theater, but we broke up. That was a movie then, theater boyfriend. And then I had a one-night stand. So that was the three. Found that my was the total boyfriend. of three. Yes. Okay, I mean that's actually believable. Yeah. I mean that is. Since she referenced like the movie But like statistically, thing. if we eliminated her, we'd make more money. <laughs> I love this guy. You see, and look at her face. She's like, this mother. And look at this guy. Look at him. Look at that salty ass hater. You see that? That's the beta male hater gaze. Okay. Look at this shit. Look at that. You guys have seen that before. When this guy. You know what this is? This is extreme jealousy. You want to know why? Because I used to be like this guy. I used to see these nonchalant alpha males come in and absolutely socially dominate. And I would be like, what the f*** makes this guy so special? And look at Sean, really. He's got a chipped tooth. He's a little, you know, he's a, he's, a, he's, a little, he's a little chubby. You know, it's nothing wrong with him. He's got a handsome face. He's clearly got game for days. But, you know... That's not what women feel, and that's not what women see. They look at your – women see things like from a social perspective. Of course, looks, they help, absolutely. They, without a shadow of a doubt, help. But if you have to choose between looks, money, and game, you choose game every time. I was kind of just playing game theory at that point. I've been the most transparent here, just saying. We've okay. all been transparent. Oh, well. Come on. I'd rather be in a relationship than just have sex with anyone. Good for you, but that didn't change my mind. Good for you, but how dare you have standards? <laughs> of course, the slut is slut shaming her for like not being a slut. Reverse slut shaming. I think a man is born alpha. I think you're wrong. It could be learned. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna lose anyway. In the back of my mind, I was. Oh my god. Frumpy. That's the only word I've got. It's girls like this that do usually sleep around because they like trying to get that social validation. Because she's like a few notches below being extremely beautiful. She's got to fix this tattered hair. She's got skin that's a little messed up. She's a little overweight. I mean, it is what it is. You know, God bless you. Be yourself. Whatever. But this is just the real world and real facts. And uh, yeah. 30 to 70. What a gap. Which means it's probably close to 100. Look at those eyes. Thousand cock stare. God bless you, my child. Let's give you a blessing with the mouse. God bless you. I was stereotyping them by the way that they dressed and acted. I kind of just de facto got everybody to kick out all the introverted people. <laughs> this guy is playing them all. I love it. I thought it was a good game plan, but maybe I was kind of messed up. <laughs> the mole's still there. Good luck. Emily, you're sowing discontent in the group. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, oh, I think they're teaming up. <laughs> no. I want to ask you more questions, like and I want to ask you more questions. Yeah, yeah. Jolie, she like winked and then forgot to open her eye back up. I think so. <laughs> like, yeah, let's, let's three in, this Hold on, you said three in the last two weeks, but... So, I went to Palm Springs two weeks ago, uh -huh. and then two days ago, I had sex with someone. Sean and I did team up. We just kind of like looked at each other, and we're just like, okay. We kind of knew that we were safe. I think he could potentially still be the mole. All right. So, ask questions. Were you religious too before you had sex? Yeah. So if I called your mom right now and I was like, he's had sex a few times. She probably already thinks I do. I mean, I've never told her I've had right. sex. You know right. what I mean? You said you were 19 when you lost? No, 16. 16. 16. Okay. Notice how the girl, you see, when a girl gets it, when a guy gets it, and you see how she mentioned that her and Sean kind of sub communicated to team up with each other? That's because she knows he gets it. Women know when a guy gets it, and women know when a guy doesn't get it. And old Beta Charlie here, this guy, or Trevor, because we actually have a friend, Charlie, from CultivateCrypto.com. Go over there and sign up for his new trading courses. Can't be calling him Beta. But this guy, Beta, old Beta Bucks here. What kind of loser wears a shirt with flowers on it?
Only the biggest losers in the world wear flowery shirts. What the? F yeah, back of the Volvo. What color was the Volvo, by the way? It was gold. It was, like it was tannish gold. gold. You mean like yellow? Like tannish. As far as the Volvo, did you have like padding in there, or was it just no, like, man. ooh, you were hurting? Just, oh. just to see. It wasn't the uh, greatest experience. Yeah. It. That's I cool. didn't, yeah. <laughs> what, was the what was the body part that hurt most after you finished? It was definitely my knee, because it was yeah, on like the little... Right. <laughs> the little right. buckle. That's all correct. <laughs> like, that's all correct right there. It was bad business, man. I'm a big guy. I'm yeah, no. Bobo, okay, that's like... all correct. Where was your first time? Where? Yeah. It was in a bed in the guy's house that we were at, and his parents were gone. Did you say 30 to 70, 18? Yeah. Yep. The math seems off. I think if you said like okay, 10 I'm not... to 15, yeah, I'd, but that's I'd believe the truth. You, but... Believe me, guys, that girl is a turbo slut. <laughs> she has all the symptoms of a slut. That's up there, especially like for an 18 year old. I'm not here to judge anybody or anything like that, but she could be coming in here trying to be like, I'm the coolest. She's saying a big number, she's young, therefore I believe it because if she was coming in here as the mole, she'd be like, oh, like maybe like 10. I think she's safe. And that Volvo story about your knees, that, that makes sense. Yeah. We haven't asked you in a while. I'm a sex symbol. Okay, well, all right, he's good there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got a solid. 25, how old are you? 27. Yeah. 18 with 30. I, I don't know, know bro. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm a, I like numbers, ask me bro. Anything. I needed to, like, sway one of them. So I was thinking, like, Trevor was the mole. Okay, we'll just go with Emmanuel for now, but he wasn't budging. I don't think he has a beard with, like, earrings and a tattoo and is oh, a virgin. Yeah. I don't what? think... He didn't throw me in the fire. It's kind of like, you know what, you're cool. You didn't throw me in. Me and Emmanuel started kind of indirectly teaming up, too, like, telepathically. You think Sean? He brought the, the hickey, which is probably like a bottle cap you just put on his neck. Oh, okay. that's... Oh, my God. This guy is such a socially inept beta male. It's a bottle cap, bro. <laughs> Tell me that's a bottle cap right now. Can I, can I, touch can I get it? <laughs> can, I, can I touch you? No. That's that's, that's a real hit. Yeah. I realize you know it's kind of hard to recreate that, so I thought it was real, but I thought it was a little scripted. I know it's not you. I'm not even gonna question that. Yeah, I, those numbers, bro. It's I'm sorry. Not me. It's not. I know for a fact those not numbers, yeah. bro. Honestly, I knew that Sean had my back. No matter what, it would have been. 2v2. There's been a tie. In the event of a tie, we do a revote. The two people who have tied are Jolie and Trevor. God, trust me. Dude, you gotta trust me, you bro. You trust me. You're, you're a smart guy. Come on, you got glasses. I can tell. <laughs> it's gonna be the same. It was obvious that Sean and Jolie were gonna vote Trevor off and then try and get me off. So it was another tie. Can we just say that we're done? And the, yeah, can we, we just say we're done? Out? Yeah. I think the mole is probably out, but I was just trying to make more money, so. Raise your hand if you want to end the game. Uh, let's just end it. I love all you guys. Just, if the it. light turns green, you voted the liar out. If the light turns red, the mole is still in the game, and you lose. All right, chat, tell me, who do you think it is? Vote now. Let's see who's right, who's wrong, who's, who's good, who, who knows their shit. Vote right now. Vote now. Vote now. Go ahead. We've got Trevor the Beta, Jolie the Slut, Emmanuel the Pimp with all the chains, and Credit Score Guy. Vote in the chat right now. Let's pull in those votes. Go, 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 go. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Get them going. Get them going. Get them going. Vote, vote, vote. Okay. Sheriff says Trevor. Trevor says Michael Samuel. Trevor says XRXE. Tony says Trevor. Stefan says Emmanuel. Sean's gonna f Jolie after the show. That's an easy layup. Black Chain, Flower Brother, Beta Male, Emmanuel, Trevor, Flower Beta, Trevor, Trevor, Trevor the Beta, Credit Score Guy, <laughs> Trevor, Flower Man, Black Shirt Dude, Trevor, the guy with the white shirt, Emmanuel, no pimp. Just got in, but going with the guy in the chain, no idea what I'm voting on, says Charlie from Ultimate Crypto. Emmanuel, Emmanuel, Flower Boy, Trevor. It has to be Black Flower Power, says Jack. The votes are in, so it's a staggering majority for Trevor. Let's go back and see who it is. What, bro? God, it was him. Was it you? It was him. It was you, you <laughs> stinky boy. <laughs> Damn. Oh, my. 
Sorry, Trevor. Most people don't expect me to be a virgin, and unless asked, I don't say anything. I get it. It's the game. I I was wrong too, guys. I thought I'd never even. I thought the gold chain, the bling. I thought this guy's black. He's tall. He's handsome. He must be a super pimp. I thought it was Trevor too. Survival of the fittest. So I I understand. I think he's a sociopath. <laughs> hey. You see how he's just that shit-eating grin after every response? He doesn't really believe the guy's a sociopath. He's just having a good old time wherever he goes. Don't judge a book by its cover. You really never know. So I'm still a virgin because I'm waiting for marriage. Um, I grew up in the church. Sex is a covenant between me, God, and my future wife. I just made that promise to myself and my family and to God that I would wait until marriage. Oh. That's a lot of green. Whoa, that's a lot of cash. Can, you, can I have some? Get that there? money. My walk of shame. Oh, yeah. My money walk of shame. Oh, yeah. Green money. <laughs> it smells It smells like, I'm just, I'm just gonna... like paper. Wow. <laughs> Guys, the power of understanding a room, being able to read it socially, and get a read on somebody. Dude, this is a life skill that is legitimately so underrated. And so underappreciated that less than 10% of all humans have it. Not... Less than 10% of all humans have it, okay? Uh, it is unbelievable the amount of normies that are out there. The normies are norming at an alarming rate. But what that means for a man like you listening in to me today, it means that you are 100% in the elite. You're in the crowd of the elite. And if you can master these skills... I'm talking about you're going to easily get a load of money, easily get a load of pussy, and live that dream life that you desire in your mind.